Oh my god, Derek, you gotta do something. You cannot let her eat that thing. Stop that! Hey, Fifi, look out for that wet butt! Ah! Oh. Oh. I am so sorry, Rick. Shit! I'm sorry. Oh, what the hell is the matter okay. with you? It was an accident. Christ, look at my sweater! I'm sorry, dude. I just totally bumped off that guy, and I, I don't really know what happened. Do you think you're funny? This sweater costs Rick, more than you make in Rick, a year. Stop it! Oh. Hey, hey, Rick! Hey, 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 Rick, hey, 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 not in here. The ring's out there. Stop hey, it! You're, you're lucky that there's girls here right now because otherwise I'd bitch slap you from here to Pasadena. Come on! Rick, I'm leaving. Oh my gosh. Eric! Are you all right? I'm good. You're so brave to stand up to him like that. I would have slammed him if Champ hadn't stepped in. What are you talking about? If you'd have slammed him, it would have been a complete public relations setback for me and my stable of wrestlers. What stable? Uh, I'm it. You're a manager? <laughs> are you kidding? I, I am the Vince McMahon of Back Bar. Wow. I had no idea. <laughs> Neither did I. Gina, will you excuse us for a second? Jeff, can I see you in my office, please? What office? You know how. Come on, babe. You act like I started it. Look at me. It was an accident. Look, I overreacted. You know I'm still wound up after a match, so I act like a jerk sometimes. Yeah. You know I always make it right. Don't I? I think that you should apologize. I'm trying to. No, not to me. Look, I'll go see those guys tomorrow and make everything cool, all right? I promise. <laughs> I really feel like an idiot. I wanted tonight to be special, but typical Rick spoils everything. Special? What's so special about tonight? What, are we gonna surprise me with tickets to SmackDown? <laughs> this was a little more personal. It was my grandma's. It was her favorite, and... I can't imagine anyone else wearing it but you. Oh! What was in that burrito? Hey, Jeff, don't dog my master plan, okay? Then I will rethink our entire partnership. All I'm saying is I'll take him on. You know if I could get him in here, I'd make Rick my bitch. No, I don't. If you got him in the parking lot, you might make him your bitch. But in here, he's savvy. We're gonna have one shot at taking him out, so we cannot blow it. All right, so what do you want to do? I mean, you're my manager, so manage. Make some moves, man. You know what? Show me what to do. I'll do it. You're right, you're right. No more screwing around. It is inspiration time. It's time to spill some blood and guts. All right, let's go, on, man. But first, we gotta wait for my parents to leave town tomorrow. The franchise in Moline will be our final stop, and from there, your mother and I will drive straight home. Now, <laughs> oh, I prepared a rather comprehensive list of names, addresses, phone numbers, everything you need, in case there's a problem. There's not going to be any problems, Dad. How about a courtesy flush? Woo. Daddy, I'm proud of that one, huh? Could knock the buzzards off a dung heap. Son, um, have, have a seat, would you? There comes a time when uh, a young man such as yourself will find himself home alone in his own house for the first time and... Uh, there's a temptation to want to... Well, you know, uh... Invite a friend over. Jeff? What about him? Not Jeff. Uh, a girlfriend. Well, well not, a, not, a, not a girlfriend. A, a friend who, who... Who is a girl who... Might be... Friendly. Uh... Hi! How's everything going in here? Everything is just fine. They're just uh, the bulls here have a little talk. <laughs> is it the talk? <laughs> it's about to be the, the talk if you just give us a few more minutes. 
my baby. Oh, oh. Sweetheart, sweetheart. Oh. It's okay, sweetheart. Oh. There you go. Oh. Yes. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, Derek, I, I think what your mother is uh, concerned about is uh, the fact that you may not be able to exhibit the right amount of self-control that is necessary while we're away. Are you talking about sex? No, well, you, could, you could put it that way. We could talk about sex. Yeah. Would you like to talk about sex? Dad, I know all about sex. Good. Mother would be very, very happy to know that. Oh, oh, I love you. I love you too, Mom. I'm, I'm gonna be fine. I'm a big boy. All right, now. Come on now, let him go. Sweetie, let go. Sweetie, you're gonna leave marks. There we go. See, he's a big boy, see? And he's gonna be just fine. Huh? Big boy. <laughs> come on, honey, come on. Love you. Come on, sweet, sweet. Remember, son, self-control. Trust me, chastity, our boy will be just fine. Ugh. I hope he doesn't find our stash. <laughs> Uncle Mac, can I use the truck for a couple hours? I need to go meet my manager. Manager? What manager? Derek. He agreed to take me on as a wrestler. I thought he was a busboy with you. <laughs> no, nah, that's just to scout the competition, you know, make contacts. Now he's got big plans for me, Uncle Mac. Let's hope they're for the mats and not the sheets, huh? How you doing, Jeff? Come on, don't leave me hanging. No hard feelings about last night. I was out of line. Yeah, well, you trashed Derek, not me. I'll square it with him. Hi, I'm Rick Caspers. Oh, Caspers. Seems to me I've been getting mail from a Caspers lately. Oh, sorry about that. Caspers. Caspers Real Estate. That's my father. Actually, that's why I'm here. He was wondering why you haven't responded. Well, you see, son, I got all the real estate I need. Yeah? Well, not for long. I've seen the records. You owe a fortune in back taxes. Wait, it's none of your business what goes on over here. Now, we're prepared to make you a very generous offer at fair market value. And quite honestly, junkyards aren't exactly Fortune 500 companies, are they? You know how you can tell the real enemy when everybody looks the same? No. You wait for him to stick his head out the hole they've been hiding in. We'll get in anyway when the state seizes it. And that means you'll have to find a new place to train. To be a loser. That boy's breath is for shit. Man. <laughs> I wish my mom kept this killer bud around the house. Hey, just don't get greedy, bro. So, do you really think Jeff has a chance to get a switchblade? TJ, Jeff has the highest threshold of pain I've ever seen. So what? So if he can take twice the pain, he only has to dish out half as much punishment. To win or survive? Rick doesn't scare me. You're not the one climbing in the ring with him. My man has arrived. That's it, I want him. If I don't put a hurt on him like right now, I'm gonna hemorrhage. Woo! Yeah! 
Ah, we switch blade. What do you think of the madman now? Ah, ah, fuck you, baby. Ah, oh, I got some kids laughing. Take him out right now. I'm gonna make you my bitch, bitch. Just say goodbye. Yo, maybe it's just me, but I think your boy just got his ass kicked by a sex doll. <laughs>